This is Eric J coming at you with Street News. No, we ain't professional and neither is 39-year-old Patrick Stallworth and 29-year-old Derek Brown, who have both been charged with capital murder and kidnapping. So look, according to the reports, the police say three-year-old Camille was abducted about 8.30 p.m. Saturday while attending a birthday party. According to the other children in the area at the time, a man was handing out candy to the children in the area at some point they said he snatched a barefoot camille and put her into a toyota suv and drove off CCTV footage released by the police last week show Camille, who was wearing a pink Minnie Mouse t-shirt, playing with another child outside the Tom Brown Village complex at around 8 p.m. on October 12th. They can be seen picking up items from the floor before a man approaches them and appears to lead them out of sight. It was reported that the man and woman had been seen enticing children with candy. Police Chief Patrick Smith said, we believe this was something that they thought about and acted upon. They saw an opportunity to take a young child, which they did. I hope that this message is not lost to young mothers, to grandmothers, and to the entire Birmingham community. It only takes a split second. We can no longer assume that everyone is part of the village that is trying to raise a child. 39-year-old Patrick Stallworth was previously charged with four counts of possession of child pornography and three counts of possession of child pornography with the intent to distribute. Three-year-old Camille Cupcake McKinney body was found decomposing alongside garbage in a Birmingham landfill. Listen, I'm going to play y'all the footage of three-year-old Camille being abducted. And in the comments, I want y'all to tell me, what's the first thing that y'all notice? Because the first thing I see is two children outside by themselves. Listen, finding someone to point the finger at ain't going to bring three-year-old Camille back. But it can prevent this from happening to somebody else's child. Camille didn't have to die. The police said that this was a crime of opportunity. They took advantage of grown-ups not doing what they supposed to be doing. It's nighttime. Why are they even outside? This three-year-old girl standing outside like she a teenager. It takes a split second for something to go wrong. This little girl, her life is lost forever. But you, you who watching this here, this is an example of what happens when you drop the ball as a parent. There's grown men out here, grown men in their 30s and 40s wanting to have sex with your three-year-old daughter. And this is what happens when you leave your three-year-old daughter unattended. Someone steps up, take her, rape her, and kill her. And this is not a scare tactic. Life is too short for scare tactics. Children are dying. And if you're not going to do what you're supposed to do as a parent, give your child to somebody else who's willing to do what they're supposed to do to protect her.